Today we're going to take a look at the round A-frame trailer jack, part number TJA-5000-B. Alright, this is what our jack looks like when it's installed in a typical application. Start off the top of our handle here, you notice that the handle itself has a zinc plate coating that helps protect the nuttle. Also for protection, our entire jack body has a powder coat finish to it. Now one neat little detail I really like about this jack is that there's a nut and bolt assembly holding the handle on. Uh, compared to some other uh, brands that are out there that just use a simple rivet, when the time comes when you need to replace your handle, it can be a real hassle to go ahead and uh, to get rid of the old rivet and maybe easier to just replace the whole jack. But with this one, a simple nut and bolt assembly, you put a new handle on and be ready to go uh, in just a few minutes. Let's take a look at the bottom of our jack. You'll notice there's nothing on the bottom there. You can actually add a couple accessories. For a foot plate to the bottom of this one, you could use part number JF-99. And also, you can add a caster to the bottom of your jack, such as part number JC-102. Now I'll go ahead and cover the operation of our jack. It's pretty simple. This is our top line style. We rotate it clockwise. It extends the jack and raises the trailer up. And then to retract it, we just go counterclockwise. Now our jack provides 14 and 1 8 of an inch of lift. So this is what the jack looks like when it's fully retracted. And then we'll go ahead and extend it down to its maximum length. Now properly installed jack right here will have a 5,000 pounds of support capacity. However, one little note here that it'll have 3,000 pounds of lift capacity. This is a very simple jack to install. A couple things to know, this is designed to work with a variety of A-frame couplers that are out there. And just double check, you want to make sure your opening is about two and a quarter inches. Simple to install our jack. In fact, you may have more trouble removing the old jack before you put the new one in. Go ahead and put it in place, rotate it so the holes will line up, and then you can install your hardware. Now our jack does not come with any hardware to install. You do have to provide that. Now the hardware we're going to use will be a grade five, a three eighths bolt, a couple washers, and a lock nut. And with this size hardware, typically you'll need a 916 socket and a wrench. And with that, it only takes a few moments to install your new jack. Now finish it for the round A-frame trailer jack. Part number TJA-5000-B. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.